And welcome back, everyone! We are playing Prison Architect 1.0, the full release. And we are back in the sandbox. Things are going well. Oh, we have a nice little, uh, classroom going here. And, oh, we just have a new batch of inmates. Are you guys new? He likes Stoneman. I think these guys have been sitting here for a while. I might want to cancel the shakedown. Yeah, these guys have been here for a while. So we definitely don't have enough stat or guards. Okay, this is definitely overkill. Alright, also we're gonna change the intake. To... Alright. We're gonna turn on this. And turn off this. We're also gonna keep this open, even though... Death Row will never spawn until we actually have the facilities for it. Anyway, let's see everyone. We have Paul Clegg, who is a gang member. We have Andrew Henderson, Ian Jerome, Warren Locke, Warren Dennington, James Waymark, Bob B.B. Jones. After the terrible incident where Bob contracted a terrible insanity-inducing disease, causing him to burst into a blind rage, murdering his fa family and two passerby. He was sentenced to 24 years for aggravated burglary, apparently. Sean Conahan. Danny Kel Kelisha? Hmm. I feel like I'm not pronouncing that right. 3D animator expended too much time playing video games, ignoring his girlfriend, so he decided to voluntarily enter into prison, and hopefully he'll be a better person when he's released. One year for joyriding. Wow. I don't think you can voluntarily go to prison. I think you'd be better off in retab or tab rehab sir but hey uh, who am I to judge right Paul Hay Matt Scales Scott Austin Ian Osborne Adam Gull Dan Hill we're intentionally ignoring this guy for just a moment Tom Fairbairn Barry Burton Barry used to work at the apple production factory checking apples until one day he snapped and shredded some fellow co-workers into saw oh god into sauce Barry warned them, but they didn't listen. They should have goddamn listened. All he wanted was a sandwich. Wow. That's... that's not good. Paul Stevenson. Christopher Barsby. Felheims Ferger Arnov, which I've probably butchered that pronunciation. Ferger, a simple-minded human. He got nothing in his life. That's... that's too bad to hear. Lars Storm Laj Hakon. Convicted for killing the next-door neighbor after chopping down his apple trees, which accidentally landed on his neighbor's head. Oh my. And... Rikuville Belanir Vask. Hopefully I pronounced that at least moderately close to correctly. Rikuville Vask was an aspiring archaeologist who was digging up a giant's church in Finland. I might as well keep time going. Convicted by the fines there, he thought was the reincarnation, or convinced by the fines there, that he thought was the reincarnation of the long-haired god Thor, and that it was the Ragnarok. He went on a month-long murder bender. Sentenced to five years for rioting, which is sort of like a murder bender. I guess. Also, let's look at our intelligence while we're here. Let's see here. So, so far, no one who looks like they're in anything particularly dangerous. Is there anyone in? Oh yeah, we have three guys in lockdown. I might want to get a camera in here now that I think about it. And let's see here. And gangs. So we have three reds, one blue, or one green, and two blues. Did I make this too big? No! <laughs> oh, that, that ruins everything. Oh, someone got... Oh, no, our first death. Alright, what happened? And why did this happen? You know, people are mostly being satisfied, so why? Oh, he was a snitch. Okay, move along, nothing to see here. As we all know, snitches get stitches, and so forth.
We have three max security prisoners. Incidentally, is there anyone in these solitary? We have three awaiting solitary. Okay. Oh, also, again, before we forget, let us hook up the new cameras. There we are. Excellent. Share the wires. Good. Oh, so apparently we didn't need to because this already has vision. Oh well. Better to be safe than sorry, I guess. Oh. False alarm? I hope there's a false alarm. Okay, and how many tables? Oh no! Wills died. Were you a snitch? Okay, so we we definitely need to get the intelligence in our prison higher. Which means we could just... Oh, oh he's a stoic, so he doesn't even care. He just doesn't give a damn. How about you? You don't want to join me? I want you to join me. Murder. Serious injury? And... Oh! Wait. You're stoical, but we can recruit you? I thought you couldn't recruit stoics. Apparently you can. Also, ooh, ooh, ooh. Nice. Polaroid. Sweet. Um, do you go away on your own? Okay, you do. Oh yeah, that reminds me. We should occasionally, like, scour the prison looking for Bible pages and... Polaroids. Yeah, the Bible pages sort of look like a piece of paper with uh, Introversion's logo on it. Logo. Pardon me. And, uh... Polaroids are Polaroids. Uh, though unfortunately, I... If you guys notice them and I don't, there's a moderate chance that if I miss them, then we're, you know, just... Why aren't you moving? Oh no, you're you're kind of moving. Okay, that's good. That's all I wanted to know. Is that you are actually moving? Because that's kind of important. Okay, so how many fridges do we need? Let's see here. One, two, three, four, five, six. Apparently, I put seven in there. Which I believe is more than we need, but... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, okay. Then we... Did something like this. I enjoy my symmetry. And... Oh, no, I want the bins to be facing the right way. I mean, I don't think those bins are really all that important, but... We might as well have them, right? How did the tables go in? Three on that one wall, three on the other, so... If we're making this, or aiming for real symmetry here... Then we have to put the two on this side. And then three... Oop, three down here. Yes, yes, it's grand. Excellent. I'm quite pleased with our progress. We are doing rather well, I like to tell myself. I'd say we're doing pretty well. I mean, we've we've only had a couple of deaths, and that's because of snitches. And snitches deserve what they get, apparently. Though, we do... It does highlight the fact that we probably should be investing rather heavily into building a proper... proper wing... for all the, our stuff. There we go. And we also need to bring a large pipe down here, which we might as well bring down here like that. And then where are all the sinks? Oh, the big pipe is going right through the middle of the sinks, so... 
something like this, I think. Should cover it. And then we'll put, uh, some... You know what occurs to me? I probably could've used the clone tool on these. And... And just regular doors, because I like to have prisoners working in here. And then metal detectors. Like so. And like so. And then speed time along. Oh, right, I never did get around to adding the utilities to this prison, so let's pause this before any gang members get in here. Because the last thing we need is gang members moving into the max block where we don't even have water. Could you imagine the scandal? They'd write about it all over the news. Architect forgets to put or plumbing in the maximum security wing. I'd be the laughing stock of the architectural community. And possibly go to jail. I mean, in real life, I'm pretty sure you could go to jail for something like that, because you would be violating basic human rights, denying people access to running water. Yes, we can't have that. And I mean, I, I side more with Dr. Hurst than Mayor Heller, who you may recall from the campaign, when it comes to matters of- oh. oh no, nothing really weird happened there. It's like I was a bit afraid the game decided to freeze, but that was not the case. Okay, this is actually going to be quite a while. But we do now have like a whole bunch of guards who are just not really. Okay, so we want one guard each in the canteen. Do we have no guards in the yard? Ever? Oh, that could be our problem. Let's have, like, two guards perpetually in the yard. Two guards on each patrol. Okay. So, let's have a look here. So we want this. I think that's just a false alarm. I hope it's a false alarm. It would be rather unfortunate if it wasn't. Alright, so we have this, and this, and then. Are you kidding me? I hate when that happens. I wish there was a way to force them to uh, prioritize their corners. There we go. Oh, no, no. Not like that. I want that, 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 and that. And I mean, eventually we'll improve this so that there's like only patrols going on during certain times of day. Like, I don't think during the day when everyone's supposed to be out of the yard, or out in the yard, or working or whatever, that we would really need guards handling these particular routes, but... Yeah. Oop. Um, that's unnecessary. And we'll eventually get the dog patrols in here and all that good stuff. Man, I always get a little paranoid every time I see one of those things happen. Because I always think to myself, maybe they actually... Has no one passed the general education test yet? Or... Foundation? Oh, 22 are interested. Oh, it's in progress still. Did someone drop out? Because that's a blank. Hmm. But apparently everyone who is interested is actually taking the course, so that's a good thing, I guess. And let's see here. We've currently made 30% of 30 license plates. Huzzah. And I think what I'm going to do is off-camera finish up all this. And... Oh! Also, before I forget, don't forget to keep sending in your prisons for me to try out in escape mode, because that is always fun. And, uh... Yes. Wait, are you new? Have we attempted... Oh, excellent. We're slowly getting informants. Slowly. Good. Let's see. We have one in solitary and one is awaiting. Oh, you're stuck in there. Yeah, I think I'll leave these locked because I don't want... Oh. And we just are coming in with the next batch of prisoners. This time... The max security stuff. Yeah, where's that no access, by the way, that we saw? 
I always hate when this happens. Okay, demolish that wall. And then finish that, and then we'll eventually get around to building that back up. But we're not going to do any major expansions for now until we... Also, um... Bu -bu 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 yard. Yeah. The inmates are going to be a little bit angry for a while. We'll, uh... We'll just mark this area as a yard. Ooh, look at all those visitors. Okay. We'll pause here, and we shall wrap this episode up. So for now, I'd just like to say thank you all for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you haven't done so already. Your support really does mean a lot. You should not be on that camera when there is no one there. I think there's a way I can set it up so like, I attach a pressure plate so that these things are only on and able to actually be used when someone is actually sitting on them. We might have to try something like that so that we don't have like people trying to operate stuff like this when no one is actually doing anything. Because that would be stupid. Anyway, yes, I will see you guys in the next video.